hi best friends and welcome back to my channel welcome back to another day of vlogmas and in today's video i felt like baking so i made some cranberry walnut breakfast muffins so without further ado let's get into it and the nash experience yeah. Okay guys, so I got this recipe from Pinterest. Um, I had some leftover cranberries from Thanksgiving. I didn't use it. So I know I didn't want to discard the whole bag. So everything will be listed down below. But first we're going to start off with, I think, a cup of flour. A pinch of salt this is all the dry ingredients um, a tablespoon of baking powder a tablespoon of baking soda and we're and a half a cup of sugar I think <laughs> and we're gonna sift all of that together along with a cup of rolled oats So you're going to set that aside after you mix your one cup of oats in with all your flour, your baking powder, your salt, yada, yada, yada. All of that, you're going to set it aside and now we're going to go to our wet ingredients. And for our wet ingredients, we're going to start off with a quarter cup of sugar and then one egg. And you're going to beat it with a mixer, a whisk, whatever you have is your kitchen. Do what you want until it is light and fluffy. Okay guys, so I thought I was recording 
for the mixing but I had gotten a phone call and when I came back I didn't press record but you get the point so now that we have it to this white milky consistency a little bit thick and nice and fluffy we're going to add a cup of Greek yogurt I only had vanilla I only had plain one half a cup of Greek yogurt and I had a coconut flavor it didn't do anything I added what I had it's your kitchen it's my kitchen I'm going to do what I want but the recipe calls for plain Greek yogurt and I had what I had and I used what I had so we're gonna add that So now we're going to add one cup of oil into the mixture. The recipe does not call for almond essence and vanilla essence, but again, it is my kitchen. So I added it in. After we have mixed and we have gotten that white, fluffy, airy consistency, we're going to combine our wet ingredients with our dry ingredients and we're going to mix, but be careful to not over mix because we don't want a tough batter. Okay guys, now that we have that all mixed together, we're going to add our frozen cranberries. The only thing I would do different with this recipe is I would put soak the cranberries, not necessarily soak, I will put the cranberries in powder sugar so they won't be so sour in the recipe. So I would dust them in powder sugar and then freeze them so we're gonna add our cranberries and our walnuts and mix that together as well
Okay, guys. So now that we have those perfectly, <laughs> perfectly in the cupcake holders, I didn't have muffin holders. Is there a difference? I don't know. I used what I had. We're going to make the strudel topping. which just consists of granulated sugar cinnamon cold butter maybe a pinch of salt if i'm not mistaken and the rest of the chopped walnuts so you have walnuts inside and on top and if you want to you can add a little bit of the oats okay guys that's it this is the finished product these was so good they did not last the night in my house if you make these muffins don't forget to tag me on instagram but while you're here don't forget to like comment and subscribe share this video with your friends and the family give me a big thumbs up it really helps it messes with the algorithm lets youtube know that i am wrong so remember you are enough you are beautiful stay safe wear your mask and i'll see you on the next one peace bye